Chapter 2 and 3 of the book of Ezekiel go together. They're really focused on this theme of the calling and commission from God upon Ezekiel's life. Let me just read a few verses. In fact, I'll read verses 1 and 2 from chapter 2 to start us off. Stand up, son of man, said the voice. I want to speak to you. The Spirit came into me as he spoke, and he set me on my feet, and I listened carefully to his words. Son of man, he said, I am sending you to the nation of Israel, a rebellious nation that has rebelled against me. God is calling Ezekiel, and he's going to send him to a people that aren't necessarily excited to see Ezekiel. And this is what God says, verse 8, Son of man, listen to what I say to you. Do not join them in the rebellion, but open your mouth and eat what I give you. And then listen to what happens in verse 9. Then I looked and saw a hand reaching out to me. I held a scroll which he unrolled, and I saw that both sides were covered with funeral songs, words of sorrow, pronouncements of doom. And in chapter 3, the voice said, Son of man, eat what I am giving you. Eat the scroll, then go and give its message to the people of Israel. Now, as you read on, well, I'll let you read on to find out what exactly happens. But this passage, these two chapters are powerful. God brings a calling upon Ezekiel's life and a commission. And you and I, we have a similar call and commission from Jesus. In Matthew chapter 28, we are called into the mission of Christ to go and make disciples of all nations. And here's the thing, just like in Ezekiel's day, not everybody will be receptive of this calling. But you and I as believers, we are sent people, sent with the message of the good news of Jesus. And so as you read these two chapters today, I hope you can find kind of yourself in this story, knowing that God has called you, God has commissioned you. He has given you his very word and put it into your heart and today, I hope and pray that just like Ezekiel, you go forth to show and to share to all those around you the good news, the news about who Jesus is, that he is the one that can bring those who are lost and make them found, those who are blind and give them sight, those who are bound and give them freedom. Believers, listen to me. You are called and commissioned, just like our brother Ezekiel.